They're asking these questions to get you to cower. They don't want to debate your ideas. They just want to discredit your ideas. They want to discredit you because if they debate your ideas, they risk losing the debate and being wrong. Whereas if they can just discredit your ideas, then they don't have to worry about whether they're right or whether they're wrong. All they really have to worry about is making sure that people think you're wrong. And the best way to do that is by labeling you a racist, a sexist, a bigot, or maybe they don't even have to get that far. Maybe they can just imply it by asking you a loaded question that puts you on the spot in front of a lot of people, you know, such as, do you really believe that women shouldn't have a right to choose? Do you really believe that transgenderism is a mental disorder? Do you really believe that we should keep letting kids die so that people can own guns and conservatives try to be polite uh, we like to say well I just think well, no I'm not actually a racist I swear it's stuff like that and the reason we do that is because at the end of the day we have a propensity towards avoiding conflict in the name of camaraderie but the left just doesn't believe that in the eyes of a leftist if you're a conservative it's not just that you disagree on policy it's not just that you see things differently but you can still share a beer to so the modern left if you're a conservative you are morally reprehensible you just have no morality and this is why so many of us have lost friends or even family members over political differences